welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I have a back to school clothing haul and I did tailor this a little more to high school. These pieces are affordable, they're comfy, and stuff that I would have loved to have worn in high school. But that being said, I do have some university pieces that I think would be great maybe for going out and then some cool jackets. So hopefully there's something for everybody and make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy my haul videos and just wanna stay tuned for more beauty videos. But anyways, let's get started with uh, the first basic piece I picked up. I'm a big fan of Airy. I think they have some really cozy, well-made stuff. So I picked up this t-shirt. It says Caffeine Queen, and I didn't have coffee in high school, but oh my gosh, I live off it now. And I love just a comfy t-shirt like this because you can tie it, you can have a bright tank underneath it like this to just add a pop of color in there, and it's really versatile. And the tank I'm wearing is also from Airy. Of course, when you go back to school, like tanks, are essential just to have underneath your clothing and they have a lot of different colors from Aerie so I love this bright blue one. This is one of my favorite colors. And another fun piece I got from Aerie are these shorts. I love this material. I think it's girly and sporty at the same time and I love to just hang out in these um, when I'm chilling at home. Another great back to school piece is this top. This is from the brand Dex and I love that it has a collar. It's buttoned down but it's this really light weight material so I know it's still pretty hot for most of us going to back to school season so something like this is airy and you can tie it up tuck it in and I think it looks great I actually really love this with a dark leather jacket I have I think it makes an awesome outfit next up I went to Brandy Melville they always have just really comfy cozy pieces that are like neutral and you can wear different ways as well so this is a really sporty but still girly dress I love the stripes I go for a lot of navy and blue clearly but you could wear a jean jacket with this or a sweater and I think it would make a great even first day outfit and a tip I do have, especially for high school, is to have a tote bag in your locker. I always carried around a tote so that I would just put in all my books and like binders up until lunchtime so I didn't have to go to my locker between classes and then the rest of the day switch them out for my uh, end classes. <laughs> so yeah, this one is from Benefit. I was gifted. It's like the cutest thing ever. But um, yeah, just a tote in your locker will really help you out. And thank you Benefit for my bag. And I also do have one gloss that I wanted to show you. I posted a picture of this recently but these glosses are great for back to school if you do love gloss because they last forever and the color payoff is really bright so if you're into that check it out and moving on to some more clothing <laughs> Every year I just want to get like one new thing from Victoria's Secret Pink. They always have really fun styles and I usually get sweatpants but this time I got this really fun bright pink shirt and you might have seen this in my bullet journal video. This is what I was wearing. Oh my god what is that? Oh that is so coffee. Oh no. Still with the white navy, I have another top from Brandy Melville, and this one is cropped, so I'd recommend wearing a high-waisted skirt with it, but it's one of my all-time favorite tops, actually. I picked out some styling jackets for back-to-school season, so first, of course, the classic denim jacket. I showed this in my Selena Gomez Bad Liar video, but I wanted to show it again. This one is from Lulu's, and I just love the distressed kind of vibe it has in the medium wash denim. Goes with so much and it just makes any outfit that you want to wear just a bit more casual. Like if you have a really cute dress but you're thinking like, oh, people are going to look at me weird if I wear this to school. Pop on a distressed leather jacket. I mean, oh, Jean, struggles. Uh, and you're good to go. This jacket is a bit more mature to me. You could wear it at any age really, but I could see it being really nice in the workplace. So this is what it looks like. I love the detailing and it reminds me of either like Spencer Hastings or even Massey Block from The Clique. And the brand is, or store, White House Black Market. Last jacket I wanted to feature is this one by BB Dakota. I think this is just a really nice shade of brown. Uh oh. Uh, because it's just something different than a dark wash and I wore this in my Serena Vanderwoodson tutorial that I made like two years ago but I will have a link down below to something similar because I think this is a great moving into fall piece and just another one of my go-to jackets. I love loungewear so I picked up this sweater from Brandy and it's the most comfortable thing. You could wear this to school, wear this at home and oh my god it's seriously so comfy. Side note, I didn't add any shoes in today's video, but I have two pairs that I've had my eye on for so long, but I can't find in Canada. So here's my shoe inspiration that I wish I had, and I'm going to the States for a bit, so hopefully I can find these pairs and get them. I showed you guys some of my casual picks, and now I do have some more dressy items. This dress is one of my favorites. It's from Lulu's, and I love the pattern of it. The cut's really nice. It has a high neckline and some really pretty detailing at the back.
I'm obsessed with this wrap style shirt. I love the feel of it, the bright color. It's just a really pretty coral that will make you stand out for sure. This really pretty top is from shopakira.com and if this looks familiar, I did wear it in my back to school lookbook. If you haven't seen that, I have makeup hair and outfit ideas in different styles, so that's in the eye. And what I wore with that top was this skirt. And this is from Forever 21, love the corduroy and the bold kind of ruby shade. If you like very flowy fashion pieces, this one is probably for you. Very girly, but it has a bit of a bohemian feel to it. And this next top is not great for school, but great for weekends and while it's still hot out, and it's this guest top. And I love it because it has their logo on there, and I really want to do like an old school vintage, not the, that was redundant, <laughs> an old school um, guest model inspired look, so that'll be coming up soon, and I picked out this top for it. Speaking of guests, I love to get jeans from there. I think they have just like great quality and great sizing. And then another pair of pants that are just way more comfy than jeans are these guys from um, Brandy Melville. And these fit really nice. They have a cool style to them. And again, yeah, just are super comfy and something more fun than plain pair of pants. I swear in every haul, I always show you guys a new tie scarf I've got from Zara. So I got this one, it's pink and yellow and I love it. I wanna do like a little, like tie it in my hair tied around my neck with like a jean jacket, just a white top. Can't get enough of these. I got these really bright shorts that have an underlining here and it's really great because then I have some shorts where if I run, you start to, they start to ride up and you see my booty. You don't with these ones and uh, the pattern's just really fun and I got these a while ago so they're on sale right now. And to match, I got this um, sports bra, really bright again, has zipper detailing and over top when I go on runs, I just have another comfy t-shirt from Aerie and they have the softest tees. So yeah, if you're looking for tees, check them out. If you love vintage inspired clothing, then you might wanna check out shoprouge.com or modcloth.com. I usually recommend those two sites if you're looking for very like unique pieces that not a lot of, you know, other, other people will have. But to give you an idea, here is something I got off shoprouge.com, just a super unique jean dress. So I will have links below if you're looking for, you know, that vintage style. Again, I featured this one in my Selena Goma 70s Mom Vibes video, but I think this would be really cute if you're in university near a country bar. This with cowboy boots would be amazing, so I wanted to show it again. An essential I have are bralettes. This one is from Aerie, and I kind of defeat the purpose of wearing one of these because I wear a strapless bra underneath so that I get a little lift, and then this just like peeks out of a t-shirt or a low cut top and you get a pop of color. But I mean, if you have more boobage, you could just wear it plain. I just need a little um, support support, well like not support, forced, <laughs> forced support I guess. And then um, we have this one, I love this pattern, very fun. And I have just a um, bandeau one, which works really great for low cut tops too. Last couple of pieces really are not back to school related, but I just wanted to show you. So this dress is so like Hannah Montana, Miley Stewart, adorable and it has sequins all over it i love this with a belt and it's from anthropology this it was on sale and i got it a while ago but um yeah i was dying to show you guys it and then i got this dress from misguided i've never tried misguided um i got something on sale but the reason i'm showing you is to pump you up if you like margot robbie's look in wolf of wall street i got this dress just to kind of like you know match the color that she wore in the sexy scene i got a blonde wig and i'm gonna recreate that makeup it's funny i'll do like aquamarine then like wolf of wall street and then we got a beach dress i don't know in case you want to hit the beach this one is again really pretty i love like embroidery and from lulu's Ooh, this one would also be a great going out top it's from topshop and this i wore in my cheryl blossom video uh if you haven't seen it check it out i loved making it but um i never wear black so this is gonna be like one of my go-to black tops and it has a cool neckline. And lastly, I wanted to show you guys this really funky bathing suit. Um, this is a one piece and it has an 80s print and I have an 80s video coming up that will have a giveaway involved that I hope you guys are excited about because I'm excited and that's it for my haul. I know it was kind of a random selection of things. Hopefully you did get some back to school inspiration if that's what you came looking for. And yeah, if you wanna keep updated with me, you can find me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. All my links will be down below. I'm most active on Instagram and I will see you in my next video.